we were on the back of two disappointing results, so we knew we had to go over there and do a job and get a win. And luckily, uh, we put in a good 80 minute performance and ground out a result, which is great. Um, it's off difficult conditions. They're a big physical side, they always are. They always uh, bring um, dominance up front in their uh, their mall and their scrum, and we uh, we knew we'd, it would take a while to break them down, and it certainly did. And we managed to. Uh, clinch in the last few minutes, minutes, which was great, so happy with the result. You know, coming off the back of a good result against Treviso, it's been a, lads are a bit happier around the place, it's been good vibe and training was good now uh, this week so far and we'll be uh, looking to build going into this weekend after uh, getting a bit, a bit of a beating over in uh, Rodney Parade last time out, so um, we'll be looking to get one over and then we're just taking it uh, week by week at the minute, trying to get in that top six and push on to the top four for the playoffs. Look, every game now is Pretty much a cup final, the top top six, seven teams are so tight up there and uh, only the top six can get into Europe and obviously the top four in the playoffs so we're just taking it week by week and hopefully now we can uh, end this block with a good win against Dragons and push further up the table. It's been a while now since we had an outing in Thomond and uh, as we said the last day against Stad it was a great team performance and the crowd got uh, right in behind us for the whole 80 minutes which was great. So, Hopefully we can get the Limerick contingent out now again this weekend because we haven't been there in a few weeks and hopefully we'll give them something to cheer about.